Is that Reva on the phone? What? On the phone. Was that your sister? Don't treat me like a complete idiot. I'm not Cassie. treating you like you're an idiot. Was that Reva on the phone? Yes. She was yelling. She wasn't yelling. She was talking loud. Whatever she was doing, she was talking loud. You know, you should have been an attorney the way you like to split hair. She wasn't yelling, That's Hart. your sister that you care so much about, right? Look, that I... That sister that you just... You, you, you can't talk to her for two minutes on the phone, but you can't leave her either, you know? It doesn't make We're any family, sense. We're family, okay? We're Zero. family. We have issues and we argue. Issues? Yes, yes, issues. And we're gonna work them out and everything's gonna be fine. You know, I didn't want to believe what, what Dinah told me about... Well, you shouldn't issues. believe I really it because didn't. it's not true. I came true. down very hard on her. I did, but now I'm thinking that maybe what she said, maybe it was true. Maybe you are having an affair with Josh. You are so wrong. I am so tired of your excuses. There's nothing wrong with excuses when they're real. When they're real, but see, yours are just a bunch of garbage. That's a horrible thing to say. Well, I feel horrible. I can't believe you're acting like this. I cannot believe you're doing this. Well, I'm mad. I'm very mad. And I think I have every right to feel this way. Why can't you just trust me? All I'm asking you to do is trust me. Trust you? Yes. Trust you? I keep asking you what's going on. You can't tell me I'm going to trust you? I'm not having an affair. I'm not. You know, this is getting us nowhere. Because you won't listen. I'm trying to explain this no, no, to no. you. No, no, you were right. You were right. I'm right? Yeah, oh, absolutely. You see, there's no way you and I could live together. No way. Not like this. Not with you hiding things from me and running around. I don't know where you are half the time. You know? I have to be with somebody I trust. Now, I don't think that's too much to ask, is it? Is it? Do you really want me to answer that? I want you to stop crying, and I want you to defend yourself. I'm trying to defend myself. That's all I'm doing is defending myself, because you won't stop attacking me. I won't stop. I won't. I'll stop attacking. Give me a reason. Give me one reason to stop attacking you. I swear. I promise. I'll apologize to you. One reason, Cassie. You tell me what's going on right now, or you turn around and you get out of my house. I still don't understand what's so important for you to be here now. Well, what's to understand? I mean, it's late at night. What's well, important, okay? Well, Michelle's probably sleeping. No, she's not. She just got back. From where? From California. She was at a big clinic getting some kind of new treatment. Well, how did it go? I don't know. The doctor called me and told me to get over here at ASAP. Now I'm here and I'm kind of afraid that she's gonna get bad news. Maybe that they told her to forget about it that she's not ever gonna be able to see again. Well, that's going to be hard for her. Yeah, it is. That's why I'm here. I wanna help her get through with it. How are you gonna do that, Carlos? I don't know. Look, but whatever happens, just... I want you to understand. Can you please take off out of here? Are you telling me to get lost now? I just want you to leave, okay? Will you please understand? Look, I'll see you when I get back to town, all right? Yeah, right. Where have I heard that before? Look, I promise. I swear to God. You swear to God. I'm going to hold you to that. That's fine. I'm serious. So am I. I'm going to be waiting for your phone call. Good night. I'll soon, call. Jesse. Yeah. Call me soon. The minute I get back. I'm just not sure about Jesse. You're not sure about uh, what your feelings for him? No. So no, no. I always love him. But right now, I need to concentrate on other things. Such as? Figuring out my life, for one. 
Boy, that's heavy duty stuff, kiddo. I'm serious. It needs to be done. I have to figure Michelle, out what I'm gonna do with the rest I, of my you life. You just regained your eyesight. That's that's big stuff. You gotta give yourself some time. Give yourself time to get it right. Okay? I will. That's gotta be the hospital. Yes, Dr. Bauer. I'll be right there. Uh, they needed me 10 minutes ago. It's nice to be needed. <laughs> yes, you ready to go? Um, actually, no, I'm gonna, I have a couple things to do before I leave this place. Oh, so you're gonna stay another night? Um, yeah, yeah, I'm all packed. So as soon as I say goodbye to Carlos and everything, I'm gonna mm -hmm. be walking out of here for the last time. Okay. I hope. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Right. Bye. Bye. Um, um, don't park. I'll be right out front. All right. And thanks for helping me pack. I'll see you. <gasps> Hola, Michelle. Carlos, what are you doing? Eh, ¿Cómo te fue en el viaje a... California? La operación, bien? You. How could you? How could you lie to me like this? Am I making a fool out of myself? Uh, what? I mean, here I am on your doorstep again. Been there, done that. And I've made that lame joke about a million times. Well, I, I thought you had, uh... No, I just hung around to 